I caught you with him on them damn slick, sticky, sad sheets. My, it's good to see a big crowd. Oh, I've been wondering where a lot of you have been. I've been wondering about a lot of things. I'm glad you're here on this Easter Sunday. Your flowers look so beautiful. I'm going to get right into the message. I'm going to lay the truth down. I'm going to uh, strap it on. <laughs> Thank you for that amen. Yes, I'm not going to spare anything. I'm not going to smooth anybody's fur. I heard your sister. Yes, I will preach on. Yes, mm-hmm. I'm going to tell it like it is, as they say. Uh-huh. Oh, I heard a hallelujah. All right, now you're all quieting down a little bit. You're getting a little too noisy. Hold it, shit. Hold it down. I'm talking. Okay, listen. I'm tired of so much shit around here uh, that I, I, I'm, I had to unload on you today. Do you think I don't know what the hell is going on? Do you think, for instance, that I don't know that Bill Broden is going up seeing Eileen, Irene Hobbs? Uh, yeah, I'm going up there tapping that. Sure, I know it. Don't you? What in the hell is the matter with you? She told me right back there in my study what she is doing. I know it. Yeah, uh-huh. And this being Easter Sunday and having such a big crowd out here and uh, a lot of strange places, where in the hell have you been? Hell, fire. You come uh, once or twice a year? Shit. That, that, that don't cut no ice with me, see? My ass, I'll tell you, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get on some asses today. Uh, listen, uh, you know, we got a Sunday school teacher, uh, and you know who in the hell I'm talking about. Yeah, Bill Bronson, that's who I'm talking about. There he sits right there, Bill, I'm talking to you, see? Uh, you ain't no more taking proper care of that Sunday school class uh, than, uh, uh, than shit. And you are finished. You're fired. Get out. You're out of that Sunday school class. Now listen, I mean business. I'm putting it down, and I? I ain't hearing no amens, but I ain't wanting any. No. Hell fire. Hell fire. All right. Okay. There's something else, too. Now, I noticed last Sunday uh, that one of you put a quarter in the uh, offering plate, see? Yeah, Raymond Welch. you the one. You put a quarter in there. Yo, you tight son of a bitch. I see all that shit, see? I'm up here where I can see it. Y'all don't uh, uh, even look or nothing. I can see it. I know whatever fucking one of you is giving, see? Some of you are doing pretty good, and others you ain't doing for shit. All right. Uh, I, I'm gonna, uh, uh, maybe go to another church. I don't know, but I don't give a shit. Because I've just about come to the end of the road. Here, I've just about lost patience with you people. You know we need a Sunday school, uh, uh space out there. And you sit on your asses on, the, uh, uh, Saturday. You won't come up and work on it. Shit, no. Uh, you say, oh, amen, praise the Lord and all that. Uh, uh, when I'm saying something that you like, but when I'm trying to get something done, shit, that's something else. You get your ass out to the mountains or someplace or hide in there and watch that damn tube. That's what you do. Uh, listen, that don't ain't going to get it, hoss and the horses. It ain't going to do it. Uh-uh. Uh, listen, I, I tell you, I this will determine today, uh, no doubt, whether I will be your pastor uh, or not, but I tell you, if so, fine, that's what I want to do. Uh, but if not, fuck it, I'm done. In fact, my sermon is done. Don't give me no more shit. Brother Woodrow, lead us in the closing prayer. Whether well, you going to do it or not, I'm a son of a bitch. Dismissed. Get the shit out of here. Shit. I never thought that shit. There's a man going around taking names. And he decides who to free and who to blame.